Hey, you thought I forgot, didn't you? No, I didn't forget. Granny's just been very, very busy today. Monday is the busiest day around here. I am reminded of a story, true story as a matter of fact. I was talking to a friend of mine earlier today. Hey, Papa, how you doing? And, um... We were we were having the discussion. I forgot how we got on it, but it ended up talking about letting go. That's how we ended up on that, letting some things go in our lives so that we can heal properly. And um, it reminded me of a little niece of mine. Well, she's no longer little. She's full grown and has her own little one. But anyway, when my niece was one, two possibly three years old, she fell in love with cowgirl boots. She had to have these cowgirl boots and a cowgirl hat, a top, and just her diaper. She was like two, one or two. And um, we couldn't get her out of those things. She would have a fit if we tried to take them off, to give her a bath, to change clothes, to, um, you know, just anything. And... It got to the point where she would put them things on every day and we would try to teach her, look, this is not the appropriate time of the year for this. Um, is they getting too small? Because they were getting to the point where she was growing so much that they were getting too small. And she had got to the point where she was out of her diapers now and three years old, still trying to put those <laughs> same boots on. So we decided, you know what? Hey, we're not going to get her anymore. And we're just going to let her feel the pain until she decides that she's tired of that pain. And you know what? Life does the same thing to us. Sometimes we try to hold on to things that were perfect for that particular time. And we get to a point where we continue to you know, if we're fed the right things, if we are given all of the right information and we are taught how to do other things for development, we forget that sometimes we outgrow things. Just like my niece didn't realize she was outgrowing her Calgar boots. We do the same thing with life. There are certain people in our lives that we have to let go of. There are certain things in our lives that we have to go let go of. There are certain places that we have outgrown because we have evolved. I just wanted to come in and give that little word of encouragement because sometimes we forget that we evolve. We still evolve. Some people's rate of evolution is slower than others. Some are quicker than others. It doesn't matter how fast or how slow you evolve. The whole point is you evolve. That's the good point part of life that no matter where you are on the spectrum, you're still developing. You're developing your skills. You're developing your mindset. You're developing even your habits and your routines, and you're learning new things. You're learning how to develop new routines and habits and, and, um, and create projects and create money. You know, we're learning these things. So I just wanted to come in, make sure I got my video in on today because Granny has been doing a lot of cleaning and cleansing today in here. And she is a little exhausted, but she is very happy. I have a lot more space, especially in my office. And um, it's going to help me to accumulate and to welcome in some more things that I really do need. So y'all have a good evening. I hope you had a great day. I hope you are well and you are saved. And I want you to remember that healing is a continuous process, not a one-shot deal.